How's the bank playing? This is a fan organ. More specifically, it's the Bontempi hit organ. But uh, it's got a fan on the inside, so I like to call it a fan organ. I do believe it might be called that. <laughs> uh, it's also a chord organ, which is a specific type of organ in the organ family, I would think. A reed organ as well, but that's how, like how it works. I haven't done proper research. It doesn't really matter what it is, because it's a very discarded instrument for good reason. It was popular in the 70s, 80s. It doesn't hold a very high value. You can find these very, very cheap. Maybe not specifically the Bon Tempo hit organ, but I do believe so. This one I actually found outside with a friend several years ago and it smelled like piss for about a year every time you turn it on. I've had the honor to play maybe five to ten different fan organs and they are all more and less out of tune. Very plastic, fantastic, mass produced. The idea is quite genius. You took the, you know, a pump organ and you figured we got electricity now. This is the 70s. <laughs> what if we put a fan inside? <laughs> kind of smart, like evolution wise. It's also probably kind of dangerous, but, but I think that it was aimed towards parents for their kids, which is a really dumb idea. It is possible that this is the worst instrument ever invented. And the reason is this. vibrating. It's got a fan on the inside, so it's more or less like turning on a vacuum cleaner. This is actually a silent one uh, compared to many others that I have had. I have one more, and this is funny. They were able to take it one step further. They thought, we have electricity now in tiny cylinders. <laughs> a battery version as well. This is also Bon Tempe. And the battery compartment is really loosey-goosey, so I should take that. Uh, three, three D batteries. You know, really dumb idea. It also, when you play it, doesn't sound fantastic. See what I did? You can't play it very fast. Like it's got latency. And the chords. Huh, so that C and that C have diff separate. Interesting. They are very much not in tune. Uh, I don't really know if there's anything you can do about that. Let's just get a reference. Not bad. And this is, as I said, the best one that I've ever come across, actually. So this one... Ooh! This one is also funny because if you hold down quite a lot of them... It has to start up again. Oh! 
<laughs> well, yeah, essentially, that's like a eh? melodica, but with batteries. Also, it's got this super cool dude here. Hey, it really hasn't aged very well at all, and one can definitely understand why. Uh, doesn't really. You never see the. Never get a studio tour and somebody pulls this one out and be like flexing about how good their fan organ is. But I believe that this one opens up for a lot of particular unique sounds that is hard to get anywhere else. Like it, it's very hard to get this air flow hum from the fan stuff like that like it it's uh, it adds a lot to a mix i have it in a lot of music uh this for example uh. huge part of the the sound bigness in that song is coming from this one and since you can evidently find these for free and at least very, very cheap. Uh, there's really no reason not to have one, except uh, they take up some space. But for like a bedroom producer, I, I do believe that you can get a lot out of it because just putting down chords and then do stuff in your doll with that. So we're gonna do that real quick on the clap song, which was the video where I mentioned this. very practical that it stands on this foot so it's just above the laptop there perfect okay th this is uh, overkill but just to prove a point like just creating some movement I also think it's quite fantastic <laughs> how you can get like the finger noise. Gonna put it in one more track. Hmm, why not? Might as well. But I wonder, do you have any leads on any other instruments that are possibly the worst instrument ever invented? Because I mean, we don't want this up top. No. You can mic it up differently. Now we were micing up just straight up on it, so that means when we play, we don't get that much fan noise, actually. This one had a volume control as well, but that's broken, so I have no idea how that's intended to work. And I mean, if it's in the reed organ family, this is like the weird uncle that's always able to take any given conversation and make it spiral out of control to like the same crappy conspiracy theory. Let's see if I can put it in this song as well. It's uh, holding a note, turning it on. I don't even know what notes those are. We'll, we'll figure it out. like vibrating within itself. I just chopped it up and put automated Archeria filters on it. I like it. Let's try the Melodica version, which is now the official name of this one. Nice! <laughs> okay. 
kind of like that sound. Let's say that. I like it. It's completely uh, not... Like, I think that's super sharp. But I think that's what's so good about it. That was cool. Let's pitch correct it. <laughs> That's so funky. Doesn't matter. My throat is kind of hurting, I guess, from being this close to the fan. Hmm. Uh. You know what to do.